Now, victims of Japan's wartime sexual slavery and their families from eight different countries will call on the Japanese government today to settle the issue once and for all. The Korean Council representing the victims says the former sex slaves, their families and civic activists plan to demonstrate in front of the Japanese Diet's lower house on this Monday. They will also condemn Tokyo's efforts to deny that Japan had coerced the women into military prostitution by trying to review an apology statement from the early 1990s. The victims from countries like Korea, China, the Philippines and Indonesia will then give testimonies and deliver a written request to the Japanese government to take legal responsibility and to compensate.